Oh, are you a friend of Sam Co? I do so hope you both appreciate the museum. It's about his family, after all. Good, kitten internet. Um, yeah. today is New Year's Eve Eve, and we're in a different setup, if you can't tell. Um, a very temporary different setup. <laughs> How do you even begin to describe the sheer number of lopsided, off-the-wall things that we have to make the setup Things work? in my face. <laughs> <laughs> like the top of the microphone is blocking the very bottom of the screen and I have the <laughs> ring light right in my face <laughs> and you should take a picture of your field of view and force editor me to actually edit this episode yeah because it is very ridiculous okay I have the picture. Okay. We'll have to come up with a better setup later. On top of it, my computer is currently sitting on top of a nightstand. Mind you, I only have two legs on my computer's case at the moment. Yeah, it is leaning a bit. A bit? <laughs> that is an acute angle. <laughs> um, we're using the TV now, finally, which is, that's the good part. But, yeah, the setup is a little jank. Um... I do have some ideas to make this better. They mostly include moving the couch. Closer. Much closer. Yeah. Because then you don't have the tripod. But let's actually get to the mm -hmm. game. So where we last left off, we have a tree branch. Yes. And we also have a couple of things we can give her for the museum, I believe. I have artifacts that date all the way back to the time of Solomon Co. There are some things I, I think would we do. kill to have. I mean, wait, <laughs> not literally, but I would pay a lot for. You see, the Co. family lost a treasure trove of old historic documents ages ago, and those documents would be priceless to have here. Huh. Those old things. Yeah, I can see why you'd want them in your museum. Their absence pains me. Jacob Coe and I have talked at length, and his great-grandfather was a troubled man. He sold off various historic documents to cover debts. They could be anywhere. Troubled is a charitable way of putting it. Great-grandpa was a walking disaster. He almost lost everything, family estate included. Those documents she's talking about, they're real. We even have a few that survived. Your father donated what was left to the museum. <laughs> Jacob did what? I didn't think charity was in his vocabulary. If you find any of that trove of documents, I will pay dearly for it. Thank you. Think of the future generations that could benefit from seeing such important history. Yep. I knew I have at least Let one me see. Oh dear lord. It's real it, it still exists this is the original charter for aquila city and you can see their signatures this is really the birth of the free star collective the core philosophy of limited government and inalienable rights all here told you it was space Thank texas you. if you find anything else please come back apparently that's all i have yeah i thought uh... i had more but that must have been I my other character. I hope you enjoyed your visit. Mm -hmm. Because they're always quest items, so it's not like you, you can... You can lose them. Right. I know one of them is at Red Mile. Yeah. The list of the original colonists. But this character hasn't gone through Red Mile. Right? Or did I? No, I haven't. Yeah, we haven't done any ranger quests Correct. On, on this one, so... That's why I was like, wait, no, no, I definitely haven't, because it was the same character that did that. I don't know why I'm moving, I can fast travel. <laughs> anyway. We have a tree branch to return. Oh, it's so nice to see things at more than 60 hertz again. 
even if a good chunk of the game does not in fact run fast enough to do that. Uh, I guess the lodge might actually be the closest location. Either Mass District or the Lodge. Yeah, we'll it's, go Mass District. I'm saying Mass District, but... Yeah, it's probably either one. That screenshot looks familiar. I know where that's at. The facility? I don't want to like it, but I gotta admit... Apparently I'm... New Atlantis is classy. ...inside of Sam Co. And not in the fun way. There he is. Yep, definitely closer to the Nat Station mm -hmm. than to the Lodge. Yeah, I just I wasn't sure. I hope Aquila City has what we need. Not anymore? Have you paid a visit to Miss no. Castler in Aquila City? She wants it back when you're done with it, though. Yes, yes, of course. I'll see that it is returned to her in one piece. Well, perhaps minus a few shavings. Now, I just need a moment to analyze this and synthesize an audio response to our friend here. All right, so we'll feed in a sample. Now the program will incorporate the genetic and chemical makeup of the sample, extrapolating the size and structure of the original tree. This was put together rather hastily, so complete accuracy is impossible, but I'm hoping it's enough. And there it is. Our best hope for a positive solution to this mess. All right. So, we now have a simulated response to our tree. All that's left is to play it. I mean, I don't really have a singing voice, but I can try. <laughs> I'm quite certain you couldn't achieve the necessary register. Far too low for human vocal cords. I've been forced to listen to this SSNN kiosk chatter incessantly this entire time. <laughs> I think it could be put to better use. I agree. We don't have time to go through the proper channels, but if you can find a terminal and get this uploaded into their system, Wait. it might do the trick. So you want me to hack into SSNN's broadcast system? Yep. To play the sounds of an AI-generated tree? That kind of seems legal Perhaps, to me. but desperate times and all that... <laughs> Certainly, if you have some other option, by all means, take advantage of it. If we do this, we deserve a medal and a parade. No tree has ever had more ardent supporters. <laughs> That's... Well, I don't need to hear any more. I suppose. And what if this doesn't work? Then I fear all this hard work will be for naught. I would hate to see this tree come down. But we may be out of options. All right. I have no doubt that you will. Yeah, I'm just going to go talk to SSNN people. That's a much better option. Hmm? I don't remember if I had an option to do that. Mm. But maybe... In the starport of New Atlantis, a nightmare of... Maybe when I did it, I hadn't really done enough stories for SSNN yet. Could be. I guess the Nat is probably closer in yep. this case, since SNNN is... Commercial district. Commercial, yeah. Nat. I could have also just fast-traveled. Yeah. My boost pack is too garbage to get up there. I wish Ridiculous. I looked like You have that look in your eye. Probably need to persuade. So, oh, a quick save would You be... have another story for me? SSN I... is supposed to be impartial, but I think the UC's got a finger on the scale there. Or a whole hand. I need something broadcast at the SSNN kiosk. Well, you've already helped me with that. I've gotten some good scoops off of you, and I won't forget it anytime soon. What's the story this time? A lonely tree. I mean, that's technically accurate. Uh -huh. Okay. 
think you're going to have to give me a little more information. Because right now, this sounds like the sort of thing that could get me fired. And possibly land me in jail for treason and or terrorism. Indeed. <laughs> I know what my other character is going to be answering. <laughs> the only way to counter a secret mind control plot by House Varun. No, uh, the tree outside of Mast is liquefying and vibrating. It's potentially dangerous. This audio will stop it. Well, now this just sounds like a practical joke. But you've been a reliable source so far. All right, I'll do it. But if I lose my job over this, I promise you, I will come after you. I have a feeling we'll see each other again. Yes, think. Yep. I like to lie, though. <laughs> yes, it was awesome. By the way, Captain, Sergeant Yumi was looking for you. Always wants to give me work. Sounds like he's got more work. Endless number of side quests. seeing reductions in the strength of the vibrations. The tree is calming down. I can hardly believe that worked. Well, you were sure that it was going to work. I did my best, but it's not magic. There are no guarantees. <sighs> All right. What happens now? I don't know. <laughs> We've been in uncharted territory this whole time. That doesn't stop now. With the immediate crisis hopefully over, I can slow down and review everything we've learned. And certainly, I'll be keeping a much closer eye on our friend going forward. And you, you have saved this tree and advanced our scientific knowledge of our environment. Noble work across the board. You have my gratitude and that of every citizen in New Atlantis, though they don't know it. A lot of money. So there was artifacting going on here behind Pelton as we were talking. Hmm. A shootout in Fedonia. An unnamed tracker opened fire on their mark in the middle of a busy spaceport. Although no one was injured except the tracker's target, this newest spate of violence hmm. has renewed the call for stricter regulation of the tracker's alliance. The Alliance released a press statement saying that the mark was accurate and the tracker in question didn't hurt anyone. Um, but if history is any um, judge, it's only a matter of time before an incident occurs with a more tragic outcome. The target was harmed. But some people might find it traumatizing to see someone killed right in front of us. Yes, them. I'm pretty sure most people would find that traumatizing. Okay. I want to progress UC plotline for a bit. Okay. So let's take a look at where we are at. Uh, we are at hostile intelligence. Oh, right. Yes. We're at Londinian. It's time to go to Londinian. Mm -hmm. Maybe we should review our weapons. Well, I'm just going to the system, so that's yeah. not a big deal. This is your first jump. No, Green. didn't, no. didn't we accidentally go where one? Nope. Genu again. You're advised to leave this orbit immediately. The United Colonies will not be held responsible Definitely for not any my harm first. you suffer by proceeding. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because you... Uh accidentally went here instead of Alpha Centauri yes. was. I'm cleared to be here. I have a meeting with Commander Hatum. Let me check my logs. <laughs> Alright, you can proceed. We'll let them know you're on your way down. Thank you. 
Now, let's take a look at my weaponry. My weaponry is garbage, last I knew. Yeah. That's Still kind of, is. That's kind of why I made us go to Aquila last time, too. Maybe I should just buy some weapons. I can almost mm. certainly buy things better than a coachman at this point. I've leveled up a few times since then. Mm -hmm. Is there any place in the... No. <laughs> no. Tolman is not a big enough... What's that ship, though? You saw a ship? Ship. Let's find out. It had better not be one of the capital ships. Well, we might find out and run away. Hey, Dad? It is. Spacer. Read to you, sure. I'd like that very much. You haven't asked me to do that in a long time. And will you do funny voices for the characters like you used to when I was little? You just try and stop me. It does disappear after a while, so maybe it would be better to reload from before going there. Eh, I'll just find it again. It's not that big of a deal. Like, I have yet to re-find one that has disappeared. Really? Okay. But I just leveled up. I don't want to lose that. You leveled up from the 20 XP from finding a new location. Yes. I think that would... That's the level you just gamed, isn't it? No, that said I was level... Hey, oh, yeah, Dad? you're right. That means no. Okay, then... Well, yeah, that's like six minutes ago. I don't want to do that. Will okay. You re Always a good idea to at least quick save before going to a ship. Alright, who would have better weapons? Hmm. Probably... Actually, probably Jamison. Really? Don't I have access to better things as a UC citizen? No, you just get a discount oh. on the same things. Admittedly, discount's nice. Mm. Or should I go to Aquila City? Let's see, weapon shops, weapon shops. There's at least two in Aquila City. Yep. Why are you going to Narion? I don't know, because... My brain decided I was over Cheyenne. I sort of think of Narian as, you know, the Free Star Collective. <laughs> Back to Aquila City then. Back to the slowdown. I mean, I'm a fan of core kinetics. So that would be Neon. Sure. Mm -hmm. I'd like that very much. You haven't asked me to do that in a long time. Em? You just try and stop me. We're not gonna try to stop you. No. Just wait until I start playing Wild Arms 3. There's an entire side quest based off of one of your characters reading stories to his daughter. My mother wanted me to be a doctor. Chakra Wand Arms first, because it's closer. I don't remember. You ask me. If, Traveling in Free Star Collectives. I don't do payment plans specials? or lines of credit. You seem all right. Okay, yeah, they yes, have. Yes, they do. And only elegance is actually better than what I'm holding right now. But they seem to be more pistols, and that's not my style. I mean, elegance is actually not that bad, to be honest. Mm, I prefer the Urban Eagle. But that's not an option here. I mean, for, for that ammo type. Mm -hmm. If you could find you a... Um... It's over here, isn't it? Yeah, I think I so. Mr. Wright's gonna be looking for an apprentice. Yeah, so. come there. Yeah. Uh, if you can find a uh, abandoned helium three facility, there's not there's enough to do around here. An advanced urban eagle just lying around. I think you'll find mm. that we carry fine weapons. Of Here's what I have in stock right now. 
even if you're low level where it would normally appear. All sorts of coachmans, and that's anything. Yeah, that's but that, it. that's calibrated coachman. You have a standard. Yes, it's better than what I have by a significant margin, but I really dislike coachmans. Mm -hmm. Because they're all two shot. And none of these have a mod that increases it. I don't think there is a mod to increase it. Oh, is it, it just an enchantment that yeah, doubles the, the... the extended okay. mag? Either way, not really available. Though, nope, this was a bust. Mm. I mean, I can buy the... Mm, probably the professional one. Well, up to you. And loading modified auto rivet. And the explosive old earth shotgun. Um no. So we had to clean up the graffiti on the range again. Why don't we just close it down? That's it's not like it gets much use. I need Isn't... some place to put the prototypes through their paces. It stays. But you know, stretch trash will come back and loiter. Or worse. Loitering. Let them. A few beer bottles and graffiti is the least we owe them. Yes, Miss Lance. You were saying? Wasn't that guy in Sidonia during the Ryujin questline? Mm, was that the same guy? I don't remember. It... Looks similar, but... Yeah, dressed the same and same kind of attitude. Mm -hmm. Might have been the same person. So there was only the two weapon shops in Aquila City, right? I believe so. Hey. I mean, you can check the general store. Yeah, might as well while I'm here, just in case. I get all take a look around. Here, browse. Take a look around. He so just turns. <laughs> Uh, nothing special. No. There's a calibrated coachman at the best, and that's it. Mm. Tends to be why I don't buy an Aquila City, because you usually only find shotguns and pistols. Let's check the UC really fast. Game. I need to figure out if there's a, um, it's commercial or no, it's residential for weapons. Yeah, the weapon it? shop is in residential. Yeah. Um, I need to find if there's like a star UI for the map screen, just to make it where I can actually click on things. Mm -hmm. This is ridiculous. It's ridiculous. I gotta admit, I miss the old girl, New Atlantis. chunks, which means weapons over here. Yep. Good old Centauri Sentinel, or Arsenal. The other weapon shop's in the well, isn't it? Uh, you haven't unlocked it yet, have you? I'm There's sure an there's something it. to be said for brand loyalty. I much rather have some, only the there... finest collection of armor. There is a weapon shop in the well, but you have to do a small quest for... Mm. Boosted old, calibrated but... coachman. Shoddies. Admittedly, a shoddy is more ammo. And a refined maelstrom, which is what I'm currently using. <sighs> Do I go to Neon? I would go to Neon. Forget yeah, it. let's go to Neon. At least fuel is free. <laughs> yes, at least fuel is free. It doesn't take me that long to go back and forth because I've been to Neon at this point. 
so I can yeah, skip the opening part. Corkinetics, neon tactical. Isn't there one more place that sells guns? Um I mean the Arbor in store in, in the Ryujin Tower, but Yeah. But they only have uh Nova Blast disruptors and Nova Light. Mm, you know, they don't sell the, the wrong one. They don't sell the third weapon Arbor makes. Mm-hmm. I need to go to Neon Core, not Neon. Going yeah. to Neon is the landing pad, isn't it? Yeah, the starport. Let's mix those up. It is not worth going in between. Just no. Neon. Some people love it. I spent too much time trying to stop bad guys here. The whole place just gives me a headache. Do they have much in the You want to head to Euphorica after work tonight? Hello I don't think there. So. Let me know if you need Sometimes anything. they have something, if I remember right. Welcome to Sick Hearts Out. How about hitting up the rooftops and watching lightning hit the span? The question should really be we carry a wide assortment. I'll bring I can back. promise you. Bring I've spent years perfecting my business by polling. So take your time. Am I? Forgive me. I have a lot of overhead in this place. And this is a prime spot, right? I'm just trying to buy something. I don't want the quest right now because this character is not going to do any oh, other quests. Oh, yes, Speak absolutely. Of. I picked up the habit from my mother. She was an extraordinary woman. Wise as well. Forget it. Thanks for stopping by. Not worth it. You're not one of the weapon stores normally anyway, although I could have swore he usually has like one or two weapons. Now, the one I want is on the other side, isn't it? Yes. Another on the this place. Here it is. Kikuchi's a lot of fun. I even bring Cora here every now and then. Need a weapon? Maybe some ammo? If you're here to buy, take a look around the shop. Just keep your hands where I can see them. Maybe. That's up to you. But rules are rules. If you don't like it, talk to Styx. He runs our um, complaints department. <laughs> Yeah. That's more like it. You know, I'm sick and tired of people coming in here and treating sticks like he's some kind of sideshow exhibit. I mean, look at that graffiti they sprayed onto his chassis. Uh, if I could find the asshole who did that, I'd make him pay for the paint removal. I just want to buy a gun. If you've I'm got just credits, trying to buy guns. Okay, what do you have? Calibrated coachman. And a boom boom. Which is an explosive. Explosive shoddy. Shoddy. Modified Kodama. I can't win. I can't get any weapon that I actually want. I mean, there's the super expensive ones at Core Kinetics. How much ammo do you have for those anyway? All right. Um, not much, most likely. All right, where was Core Kinetics at? In the Trade Tower. Okay, Trade Tower is... That's Reagent Tower. Want to challenge your instincts and hone those core real life here? The perfect marriage for you. Here's your own Eglin's have a ride. Enjoy one of our distinct coffee. Madame Sauval always gives me that. Word is the Borealis, you know? The deep Astral Lounge. I mean, confession time, I used to blow off some steam there. Bad idea. Yes. Core Kinetics. Given where I'm going, it makes sense for me to buy here. I call this place a one stop kill shop. Oh, you Get have to you, listen right? to his speech. Yep. You look like someone who craves serious firepower, yeah? Well, don't sweat it. I've got you covered. Why do you have a bad French accent? 
<laughs> Ooh, I like your style. And I'm not just saying that, I mean, I really like your style. You see, I had you all figured out the moment you walked into my showroom. I said to myself, Matthias, that looks like the kind of person who blow a hole in the wall to get to their goal. I'm talking military-grade, state-of-the-art weapons hardware. Click. Bang. Am I right? <laughs> <laughs> Looking more for a clank. Boom. Skip to the park where I can just. Oh, <laughs> don't worry. We sell all sorts of. Imagine being completely surrounded. You, my friend. So, what do you. I'd say I'm ready to buy some guns. Please. No, please let me sell gu buy a gun. Let's get you tool. Thank you. Every weapon comes with our target. Okay. I think that's gonna be my best option. I am very fond of the mic shot. Yeah. Small chance to frenzy a target, though. That seems interesting, except that I'm given what I'm fighting. Mag shot is also very nice. It has a very high fire rate, so it eats ammo. Yes, it does. So... That's always been my problem with the mag shear. Also, the ammo isn't cheap. No, it's not. Poison, on the other hand, sounds like a great idea against things with lots of... I'm thinking I'm going to pick up both a mag shot and Poison Storm. Mm -hmm. That's a heavy, though. Yes, it is. And the other is a rifle, I believe. Pistol. No, yeah, I mean, oh, yeah, uh, that one. Mine yeah, mag uh... shot is a pistol. Can you give me ranges? Yeah. Kind of want all three, but that's a lot of money. That's more money mm -hmm. than I have. And also... In fact, um, these two combined are almost as much money as I have. And I need to buy ammo. Yeah. So maybe not. So, yeah. Because... How am I doing? I have 460, 50, and 64 43s. I need to buy ammo. Oh, that one is fully automatic. Mm -hmm. So it... Goes through ammo really fast. Yep. I would get one that's not automatic. <laughs> Even though it doesn't have as yeah. high of a DPS. Ugh. I mean, armor piercing rounds is probably useful against. Yeah. Um. I mean, uh, depleted uranium rounds is better. Maybe I just go for the poison storm. And then throw all of the rest of the money that I have into ammo. Maybe. Uh, let's see. I have 400. So that's. Screw it. Just buy it all. I actually don't own any 6.5 millimeter. Yeah, that's uh, Mag Pulse and the Mag Sniper. Yeah, which I can't buy anyway. Not yet. Not yet. Mag Sniper requires a higher level, if I remember correctly. Oh, yeah. Are you getting any mag shot? Probably should. Maybe get the base one and try to modify it on my own. Because it's a lot cheaper. Mm. One, please. And let's buy more. That's all I can buy, but um, let's modify it first. Mm -hmm. All right, well, I don't believe be a stranger. Yeah. I was say, I'm pretty sure there is a weapon for it. Please move, thank you. These are some of the best guns money can buy. Okay. Well, if I only had the money. So, um, I do have the ability to do that. I would need some nickel. Long barrel gives me longer range, was it? We've got plenty of hardcore fire. Yeah, yeah. but magnetic Go rails on. is the one I usually... Get it? Which I can't do. That requires tier 2. Yeah, and also long barrel has better accuracy. Yeah. Can't do that. What can I sell you today? Take Could do a muzzle break. No, because 
We don't have the yeah, resource. If we had the resource. Oh, that's right. That's a muscle mod, not. Ready for some serious can't do any of this, can I? I could do a tactical magazine. Which just makes the entire gun slightly lighter. Yep. Internal mods are the highest end. Yeah, I can't you do buy some weaponry? anything your guy. as usual. Because you have to invest so freaking many perk points into actually doing anything. Yeah. The, this is all I'm technically capable of doing. Mm -hmm. Ready for Not some like serious firepower? Out of curiosity, you can't touch any of that. <clears throat> and there's no alternate skin for me. Well, that was a waste. Okay. Let's what just head out. What can I sell you today? Just had some troll. Now I think I'm gonna be sick. Yeah, don't blame you. Troll's awful. Uh, go out to the lobby and then patch travel. Uh, troll isn't even that cheap, is it? No, it's not. Isn't it like seventy-five credits? Okay. Anything else that I should be doing while I'm in Neon? Trying not to get every single quest in sight. <laughs> Can't think of anything else. Not unless if I wanted to sell stuff. Benjamin Bayou is so not compensating for anything. Egomaniac. I mean, you could pop into the ranger station and get the magazine there for 5% faster draw and reload with Laredo guns. Yeah, not worth it. No, uh... I really dislike Neo. Let's actually go do what I was yeah. trying to do. Dollar man. I have never um, heard like the name Toldeman before this game. Mm -hmm. But I was looking at like You're advised to leave this orbit um, immediately. Bright the stars as seen from Earth. And mm -hmm. Toldeman is actually the name for the yeah. star. Let me check my logs. I believe every star is actual. Every star in this game is actually a real star. Well, there's only one landmark I see. Mm -hmm. Hey, good news! The water's safe. Yeah, and, and it's exactly one G, and uh huh. There's low, it's just low solar radiation. It's like, it's almost the paradise planet. It's just a little cold. Setting down. Everything it just means green. bigger polar caps. Mm -hmm. The habitable zone is very yeah. lovely. So, can I bring Sarah with me? Hmm. Uh, bring whoever you want. I like Sam. Yeah. I like Sam too. I'm just thinking Sarah might have some unique dialogue. I mean, they probably all have unique dialogue. That's fair enough. This Before I forget. this quest line is more fleshed out than yeah, that's a fair the point. rest of the game. Yeah. Um, let's add things to. Let's see. Mag shot. You are going to replace this pistol. And... Admittedly, that pistol actually has a higher DPS than the magshot. Oh, maybe it won't for right now. However, this definitely needs to replace something. Probably my tombstone or ashtotamer. Ashtotamer is really low down. Modified EM Equinox does not need to be equipped, though, so I'm going to take that slot. 
you can. Darn it. Uncargo hold. Okay. Uh, I can go into the cargo hold. Do not need that. Do not need that. Do not need that. And your old co coachman? Oh yeah, I don't need the old coachman either. Oh, that weighs anything. Okay. Just trying to remove bulk sure. given that I have something really heavy. Uh, is Sam carrying anything for you? I don't think so, but we should double check. Hello there. Hi, Cora. Wherever Sam is. Well, if he was sitting there, I think. Yeah, that's him. Yeah. Any day you make it through is a vic. Share the wealth, right? No. Okay. Goodbye. All right. Told him in two. Let's go. Yeah, we only have 19 minutes left. Yep. I knew I should have brought a parka. <sighs> minus 18 isn't that bad. That's the average for the planet. Extreme it's... cold, snow. Because it's snowing, it's extra cold. That doesn't make any sense whatsoever. No, it doesn't. Obviously, somebody did not live in a cold place. If anything, the snow... Would actually mean that it should be warmer. Yeah, because the snow acts as insulation. And I'm about to lose all of my... Resistance. Can't talk to the robot. Or the turret. Inside the barriers, double time. Where? Proceed. Okay. Hey, you ski. I love skiing. You should see Cora. She's a terror on the slopes. Do what the commander's expecting you. I wouldn't keep her waiting. Sounds like. Yeah. Where? Further ahead, I think. Uh, let's actually change the quest. Mm -hmm. Ah, so targeting training. practice. Okay. Which means this is not healing. I will take all of the ammo. Thank you very much. The funny thing is, um, the uh, target mannequins are wearing neon business suits. Yes. Flynn's shipbuilders, Gal Bank. So this is the remnants of Londinian. Yes, I believe so. There's a Terra Brew, or there was a Terra Brew. Was. The command post is moving. Former terror brew. Now the command post. Yeah, just slightly smashed. Can't get the new. None of this is stealing, which is a little weird. Yes, just eat the butter. Well, oh. all right, commander. I pride myself on knowing everyone on this world, and I don't know you. You're with the collection team, then, I presume. Either that, or you're one deeply unlucky trespasser. I have my water back. Oh, yeah, sorry. I'm just here for the coffee. Black, two sugars, please. Hmm, deflection. Lovely. Nervous, then. I certainly wouldn't blame you. Well, perhaps I'll just get my answer from them instead. Commander Hatoum. I'm no need for introductions, Major Sinon. Dr. Walker, your reputations precede you. 
Can I also presume they're with you? Oh, uh, the captain? Yes, ma'am. Couldn't do this without them. Hmm. Then let's not waste any more time. Now, I'm getting the Indian is one of the most dangerous places in the Milky Way. It's for good reason that. my soldiers and I do everything we can to avoid entering the city. Terramorphs are omnipresent, and the structural damage left behind when... when Major Sanon's father bombed its spaceport has turned large swathes of the metropolis into a decaying labyrinth. As such, we'll be providing you all with gear, information, and uploading municipal unlock codes to your robot. Every tool you could need to succeed out there. Except one. Once you're on the other side of those barriers, you will be on your own. If you get into trouble, my people will not be coming. Do we understand each other? Maybe ask about the bottom option? I mean, we kind of know, but... I forgot to cast the ability uh -huh. to foretell things. I'm not used to doing that. The initial Terramorph outbreak that overran Londinian during the tail end of the Colony War came as a complete shock. Waves of the creatures appeared out of nowhere, and the city was quickly overwhelmed. There were some attempts at evacuation, but Ve Victus decided more definitive action was merited. He ordered the spaceport to be bombed, ensuring no other ships could leave the city. Halting the spread of the outbreak, but leaving large sections in ruins and condemning countless lives. And the intervening 20 years have only made Londinian more hostile, not less. So my people will not be coming for you out there. Understood? What are we gonna face out there? Terramorphs, and plenty of them. Outside our little sanctuary here, much of the planet is theirs. For that reason, we keep our trips into the city to a minimum. That also means our intel becomes largely historical once you go much beyond the defenses. It's also why I want to make sure I'm being crystal clear. Out there, you're on your own. Yeah, that's very obvious. Can I have your heaviest ornaments, please? Hmm. <laughs> we'll do our best. I'll leave you to your preparations, then. You can find your equipment in our armory, base of the tower just outside. And I do believe there's someone waiting for you there, Captain. Now, once you're outside the base, it's my personal suggestion you make a beeline to the nearby Aceli's plant. It contains one of our field caches. Though, I can't guarantee it won't contain anything else. I hope you all find what you're looking for out there. Robot, you're coming with me. Yes, ma'am. Thank you, Commander. Percival, you all set to hook into their comms tower? Should only take a few minutes. Let's get this done and get the hell out of here. Percival will be scanning the city for our samples from here. When he finds one, he'll transmit the coordinates to us out in the field. Oh, you're coming with me? Hey, look, my frostbite's getting worse. Mm -hmm. Pinpoint's a bit strong. The equipment will be able to get us a rough location of any acceptable samples in the scan area. It'll be up to you, Kaiser, and I to find the things. All right. Head over to the armory and gear up. Once you're done, we'll meet by the entrance to the city. I could uh, really bend your ear when you got a moment. Yeah, um... What I want to know is... I, I'd, uh, I'd appreciate your advice. After our last talk, I... Well, I just feel a little more at peace, a little more whole. Cora's grandpa, good old Jacob, well, he just will not stop pestering me to see Cora, and that's complicated. Uh, what I want to know is, how have they not invented better spacesuits to prevent me from getting frostbite when I'm just in a snowstorm when it's only minus 18? Seriously. Mm-hmm. Yeah, the environmental, the heat and cold doesn't really seem that no. consistent. Like, I have definitely been out at minus 18 with skin exposed. I wouldn't recommend it, especially not if there's wind chill, but... Yeah, if there's no wind chill, which I'm indoors, there shouldn't be, then minus 18 is cold, but not that cold. I mean, can you blame them? She's something else. But things with my dad. 
My early years, they uh, weren't good. My mother died when I was seven. Some people have such strong memories from their early life. Me, I mean, I remember her. I have some pictures. I remember the feelings, but just a few clear memories. What do you remember? She had these truly ancient cameras, like caveman type things. To the room with a red light, she developed pictures she took in this chemical bath. I remember sitting on a stool, looking up at them slowly fading in, and it was like alchemy to me then. And that's all I have. Just glimpses like that. What happened to her? She banged up her knee real good in an accident. So she went in for knee replacement. Supposed to be routine, but that damn anesthesiologist dropped the ball. And one day mom's fine. And the next, doctors take her away. Sorry to hear that about your mom. Oh, yeah. It's all right. It's ancient history. So, Jacob raised me on his own. And... Shit, maybe I don't give him enough credit. I mean, I know how tough it is. But he was strict. Hard. Dad was a longtime civil servant, a big man in government. And he had a future all laid out for me. And man, could he get his hooks into you. He was scary good at that. What exactly did your dad do? At his height, he was some sort of trade minister. A very prominent man in Aquila City. And after I came along, he stepped down to a lower posting. He saw a finger in trade all over the collective. I can't deny it. He sacrificed a lot to be closer to Mom and me. Uh, let me guess. Future wasn't for you. You know me too well. But I tried. I felt the weight of legacy. I wanted to do him proud. He said I had to learn the business, run some freight, see how credits flow, speak the language. Meanwhile, he's working some angle for a government job for me after. That sounded even more miserable than what I was doing. Oh, I miss, wish we met a long time. That's not even a flirting line. Imagining you around back then. Let's just say you would have been, uh, distracting. But I had a point. <laughs> If I could remember it, even after I was with the Rangers, Dad was just always kneeling, angling for me to join the government. But by then I knew myself more, and I could stand up to him. And Lillian, while well, she helped, if I let Jacob into Cora's life, he'll dream up some big future for her and tie her into knots like he did with me. A man could teach a master class in manipulation. Hmm. Definitely should have cast the precognition mm -hmm. spell. Have you seen any evidence of it? Well, no. But he hasn't had much opportunity. And he's a sly one. I'm not sure I'd be able to spot anything. But it should be up to Korra, because mm -hmm. otherwise you're doing the exact same thing your dad did to you. Yeah, but she's only 12, and... <laughs> well, I see what you did there. If I just flat out say no, I'm a hypocrite, right? <sighs> I guess I got more to think about. Mm-hmm. Also, save in case you suddenly die and have to do that conversation all yeah, over again. Yeah, that's a good idea. I'm just going to loot some things, because I can... And I need loot. Med pack. Yep. Master level lock and not? Um, ceiling? 
What is in you? What secrets do you have? Well, let's auto slot the first one. Make this easier on me. Uh, there's no threes. It's going to have to be a two and a one. It's very uncommon for for it to be just one. Although just earlier today I picked a lock where the last ring was three ones. Sturdy advanced deep core space helmet. Eh. Actually, that might not be too bad of an idea now, since Terramors mainly, mainly do melee attacks, but... I would stick with what you have, probably. Yeah. Nope. Expert. Thing. This has to belong on this row. And it only fits here. Do I have a three? Yes. Not that I couldn't have done it with three, but. The Bridger. And it's Space Adept. Of course it is. Space Adept is such a terrible enchantment. Delicious. Hey look, it's an Osmium Dagger. You just discovered a secret about that. Well, secret's a strong word, but you discovered something about that. Yeah, a nifty thing. Yep. Would you like to share with the class? Uh, if you turn on the, um... Those codes will allow you to temporarily restore power to most cities in the city. Systems should shut themselves back down automatically. Duly noticed, Commander. In, uh, Star UI, you can turn on manufacturer name... Mm -hmm. ...for weapons. Like so. And the Osmium Dagger is made by Arboron. Mm -hmm. Which is the same makers as the Nova Blast Disruptor. Osmium Daggers are stupid. They're really heavy for how much damage they do. They're made of Osmium. Mm -hmm. That would, in fact, make sense. Ah, that's the store. All right, what do you got for me? Modified drum beat. A bunch of 11 millimeter ammo. Armor plated UC anti Xeno pack. Ooh, and it's fast and, and sturdy and armor plated. And now I have hypothermia. Excuse me. Incendiary UC anti Xeno space helmet. Sentinel's UC anti Xeno spacesuit. The United Colonies agent that wants to talk to me. Leia, right now, you've got important business. Yes, I do. Let's get to business then, shall we? What? The cabinet sent me. They wanted you to have something. Make sure you had the best tools for the task at hand. Now, if you'll excuse me. Okay. You can stand to drop a few pounds, and I don't mean a diet. So they gave me a minigun. A micro gun. Micro gun, but it's a minigun. Mm -hmm. Was not expecting that.
like the minigun, it's a little annoying how it takes time to spin up, but once it gets going, it's... We're out of time. Yep. It's really quite effective, but I like giving it to my companion. So they can deal with the annoying part. Oh. oh. But it's not stealing. What? I am so confused with the way this game is working thus. Like, it is literally not labeled as stealing. Yeah. I was told to come in here to loot stuff. But I that yeah. does that should not count. I am saying that is a bug. Mm. Maybe you should treat your afflictions. Yeah. Maybe you should go back to the ship and drop off yep. things you are I'm going to, to do all of the above. But I'm going to treat the afflictions once I'm on the ship. Yes, I know. Hypothermia became worse. Now I have difficulty breathing. <laughs> Look at your status effects. <laughs> Severe frostbite. Uh, taking health damage expends oxygen, melee attacks deal less damage, running uses O2, and sprinting immediately exhausts all O2. Hypothermia. Ship weapons cost more to fire in targeting mode, and O2 recovery is reduced. But luckily I have increased O2 recovery at the moment, and I have Serpent's Embrace. You have a uh, personal atmosphere. Yeah. Inner one, isn't it? Upper. Okay. And I'm also over encumbered. Don't forget that part. It did not fill it. Okay. Yeah, it sometimes <laughs> lags a little. I'm also going to rest on the ship just to make the snowstorm go away. Hopefully. Hopefully. And we will stop it at that point. Mm-hmm. Freaking hell! Yeah, I'm thinking stop the recording here and then do that... inventory management and then... Sarah's attempting to vibrate into another dimension because she ended up occupying the same spot as Korra. You need? And this is why Starfield is not Game of the Year. This is why Starfield is race rated mostly negative at the moment on Steam. Hope you're enjoying this, Internet, and I'll talk to you next time. Bye. Bye.